Hello, everybody in YouTube land. So I am back. I'm back. The video I have is an unboxing. And I know there are a dime a dozen and whatnot, but I don't have one. So on my channel, I'd like to have at least one unboxing. So that's what we're going to do. First of all, I'm going to turn around here and grab this TV remote. And we're going to mute this thing real quick. Because I thought, y'all know how I said I wanted to get my videos better. I thought I was going to have a little background music or whatever. And you know what I mean? So I get my stuff together. But that ain't going to work because that's just distracting and take away from what I got going on. So, the UPS man. Um, UPS is a carrier for Louis Vuitton. And he just dropped this thing. And I'm going to open it. Because I want to do the whole unboxing thing. I love how you open it up to this Louis Vuitton here. Presentation is everything. And we open this big old box because we got a big old box in there and I'm so excited. I wish that after you spent so much money with Louis, they would send you like a little free gift. You know what I mean? But anyway, so we all know how the card holder or the receipt holder um, goes with just the, the thank you in it, the receipt, the return label if you desire to do so. Uh, hopefully I will not need that. Set that to the side. Once again, I know we've seen all of these, but there's your beautiful gift box. And we are ripping into it, y'all, because you can tell by the title what it is. But listen, I went through a little bit of something to get this piece. When I tried to get it in Atlanta while visiting my son, I was told there were three of them in the country. And because the inventory was so low that he wasn't even able to get it for me. So I got on the website like a day ago. It said add the bag. And you know how it says add the bag and you gotta like do a double take. Like, did it just say? I gotta stop talking, y'all, and I'm gonna tell you why. We're looking at this for the first time together. But I spit a little bit sometimes when I talk. And I don't want to spit on this bag, so. <sighs> okay. So I'm going to give this bag like the once over with y'all. And then after the video, I am going to like so, so, so look it over. Because I feel right now like I don't like that it came with the strap on. I'm just going to keep it real. So I'm flipping to the bottom right quick to see what the vachetta at the bottom looks like to make sure this wasn't somebody's um, change of mind or I don't like it or whatever. So, I mean, it looks okay, but I, I'm sorry. And you know how we do. There are certain things we like or don't like. I don't like that the strap was already on. I think the strap should have been rounded and put inside and I'm looking at the brass I'm gonna call it brass I don't even know what it's made of anymore but um, yeah just kind of looking at that to make sure it looks okay now I'm looking inside so let me let me let y'all see it cuz it'll take just the smallest thing to like throw you off you know what I mean y'all know you shouldn't have my strap like that I'm sorry it's not a quality issue and I'm tripping right now, but I'm used to, I've been doing Louis for a long time and I'm used to, you know, pristine. I'm used to presentation. I'm used to top notch, you know, and I'm going to have to share with y'all in a video, my recto verso experience. So yeah, we'll do that in a later video here. But right now I'm trying to get past, um, them just, yeah yeah all right y'all help me out <clears throat> say a little prayer for me because i'm i'm a little ticked with them right now so anyway let me let me get this up look how the strap goes like it's going to like teeter so maybe once you get it on your body excuse my attire this is my loungewear and i'm certainly lounging today so this is the bag it is a shoulder type bag First impression, I do love it. It's a unique piece. My understanding is 
that it is a limited edition runway piece, but it is a little cutie patootie. Yeah, the crossbody thing is not gonna work because the strap, the shoulder strap is way too short. But I did see a video where, let's see if I can do it, but someone took the handle off here, the shoulder strap off on the other side, and did a number like this to make the strap longer. And that'll give you a crossbody effect. And I thought what I'll simply do here, because that doesn't bother me right there. But I'm thinking what I'll do is put a little charm, like a bag charm, like here on this claw. And just let that bag charm hang there to give it a little bit of interest and take away from what we got going on here to try to um, make this thing work. But here it is, crossbody. If you, if you choose to do so, if not, you're gonna do the shoulder strap thing. Um, I love it. It's small. My hands almost touch. If I squeeze, they will touch my fingers. But it's a, a small little guy. I think this is like five, five and a half inches. I don't really remember, but it's small. So I have the Papillon and um, it's the cylinder type bag. I was even trying to like turn it on its side and hold it up against my body to try to get a feel for whether or not I thought I would like this. So my first thoughts are I like it, but those thoughts are clouded just a little tiny bit. If you're anything like me, just a little tiny bit, they're clouded by the way this strap was already on here when they sent it to me. It should have been rolled up and plastic would have been perfect and then tucked inside of the bag. But this is it. Maybe when I, um, once again, here I am with a new bag talking about, well, when I wear it and love on it a little bit, um, I'll come back and show you what I've carried in it or what have you and and let you know my, my true thoughts on it. Because right now I'm just like, love it. But I love everything, Louie. Don't let me fool you. Uh, I have ordered the Apple Guard. I ordered that from Amazon yesterday. So I think it said it gets there like Monday or something like that. But I'm thinking with all this vachetta at the top, vachetta, vachetta, tomato, tomato, um, that that's risky, a little risky. So I'm thinking, I've been watching a ton of videos on Apple Guard and other brands out there, but I'm thinking I need to do something to have this to be um, stain resistant because yeah I don't I don't want anything falling on that so anyway guys I'll be back I'll be back I'll be back so I hope you like it it is the Louis Vuitton duffel d-u-f-f-l-e and I think it was like 2640 I think that was the price of it 20 that was the price with tax thing yeah 26 something with with tax here in in my state so at any rate guys it's available it was available as of july 30th 2021 but yeah love 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 it if you have any questions about it please let me know and like always i will do my best to answer so all right take care and i will see you soon bye bye oh i forgot to say that's my time Peace. <laughs>